Hi guys, the only way to learn is when things happen. Right, so this message here comes up, reboot and select proper boot device or insert boot media in select boot device, press key. Okay, this is Arch Linux. Let's investigate. Control Alt Delete, I'm rebooting. And then you have to know some key bindings and sometimes they tell you what key bindings there are. An F2, an Escape, an F8, an F11, something like that. And it does not show it right now. So I'm just, I'll have to guess. I'm gonna go for an F8. So I'm keep pressing like I'm a very a nervous stick or something. Voila, all right. And you get something. Please select the boot device. Basically, I could actually boot now straight away from the machine if I do this. But entering the setup might be also interesting. So this is a beautiful UEFI BIOS utility system with an EZ mode, probably easy mode, right? There's also an advanced mode somewhere up there, exit advanced mode. So lots of information here, also a graphical. I do have a mouse, which is great as well. Uh, this is looks a strange thing here. Just notice it. That's an old computer, eight years old. So what I'm missing here is the boot priority. So somewhere there, somewhere in there, in your boot menu, F8, you'll have a um, way to say boot priority. And it wants to boot with this guy. No, you should boot with the UFI first. That's where you boot from, not from the hard disk, from the home and the root and all that. You start booting from the UEFI. So first this, then that, and then eventually this has indeed still a DVD-ROM in and never buy them anymore. Don't need it, don't want it. And now we need to exit or escape or default. Let's try this one. Yeah, save changes, of course, and reset. So this was a bias thing. This is, well, it's not called BIOS anymore, it's UEFI, but it's it's still the same system setting that we were missing in order for Arch Linux to boot up, because we need to have uh, this possibility. All right, that's all for the video. It's a BIOS tutorial.